Bryce Hospital, or specifically the Jameson Center, was completed in 1939 and housed patients until 1977. While related and known as to have housed the mentally insane, the Old Bryce Hospital and Jameson Center was actually used as a school for the mentally retarded and handicapped. Hello, Bryce Hospital. Well, actually, yeah, this, this is the Old Bryce Hospital. This is actually known as the Jameson Center. There's some outbuildings, which we didn't get to see before, so this time we actually will. It's really bright outside. But she's graffiti as ever. In addition to many other hospitals, claims of abuse were rampant, but also due to the laws of desegregation, the Jamison Center was officially closed in the 1970s. Originally, we were going to come at night, but, you know, can't always get perfect scheduling. But we wanted to check on this whole light situation that we ran into, me and Noel last time. And also Noel maybe seeing a guy jump out of the window. So I figured daytime might be a good time to come look and check it out. And we'll see. Because actually, this, I'm not the only one who's had that light experience in the back. Some other people did a few years prior to that. So... We're just here to check it out, uh, get the scope of it again during the daytime, and then maybe do a follow-up eventually, uh, if we get the opportunity, so. I don't think ever came back this way. Oops. Uh, well, we looked through them. We just never came into this room, I don't think. Is that a building back there? That isn't right there? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's... Well, what I'm saying is, uh, and I'll point out something a little later about that. Um, so, yeah, we're going to go back there and look at it in a little bit. We'll go back there. Because we didn't walk out back after we were in here, after we got the right way. We didn't go in the back again. So, yeah, like idiots, the first time I got here. We ended up walking a trail in the back by foot and coming upon the place from the back. Well, now we're coming in the right way. So after we went in the front that time, we didn't go out back because we'd already been out there. So this time we'll go out there the space during the day and look. Yeah, all 
these damn brick tiles. That's worse than it was. Did you say something? Um, I heard something, but... No, I mean, did you just whisper something? No. <laughs> no, I'm asking. I mean, I'm asking because if you didn't, I, I heard know. it. I heard it too because it was right here. Okay, I can it was right here. I heard it. It was it sounded like two words or something like that. I was like, okay. <laughs> that's why I asked you. I was like, did you say something? Because <laughs> this is right where I thought I heard. I think I got whispered to before also. Huh. In the first video, when I heard a whisper. Because I asked Noel the same thing. I'm like, did you say something? <laughs> so that's interesting. Well, by all means, let me just openly say, if anything is in here with us and would like to talk to us, please come, come say something. Talk to us. Talk to this uh, thing I'm holding in my hand. Anything you want. I do not talk too much so that you can do all the talking for us because we want to listen to what you have to say. That's a bird outside. That chirping. Same thing as on the other side, just a hall that connects all the other rooms. stairs were the best ones. They look the best anyways. People do go upstairs, so it's like it's impossible. We just didn't that night. Well, again, if uh, anyone does have anything to say, you can uh, come talk to the device I'm holding in my hand. You can whisper into our ears. You can use the energy from the device I'm holding in my hand. Take power from it. And communicate. Say something. A lot of people come here believing that you do exist. So now's your chance to uh, prove them right. And prove everyone else wrong. I can't tell if there's something from outside or if I'm hearing a whisper. It sounded like three words, but I can't tell if it's coming from outside or not. I'll listen to the audio. So it should pick up pretty well on the audio if it is something I heard. But if that was you that just said something to us, you know, follow us and keep trying. Speak louder. Use more energy from the equipment I'm holding. It's fine. This area back here. If you want to just hit this first, and then we can go. We can go about see about downstairs and upstairs. There's another staircase back here too, so it might be better. Who knows? So. This is also the area I heard another whisper, or I heard like a breath. So then, for perspective to the video, for you, Sam, and for anyone else who actually watched the whole video of that, those windows are where Noel saw he saw someone jump out. Now, he was back there, 
but he swears he saw someone jump out that window in the back where we saw the light and where the other people saw the light oh. in their video. That's why it was kind of substantial. You know, I don't know if he was his eyes were playing tricks on him, but it kind of makes it interesting, adds up in a way. So if that's you, are you a spirit that roams the back? Did you jump out the window? Do you stay here? Do you scare people off? Just from looking at that staircase, I probably wouldn't use that one. There's probably a bunch of shit on it. I would say that other one is probably, probably the best bet. Yeah, let's do that. We can do that first. We can go outside first. Drop the light. All right, we're gonna climb out here. And that's e That's convenient. Someone jumped out the window and it's ground level. Oh, yeah. I didn't notice it was ground level. I, we never came back this far because I was like, I don't want to go back there. <laughs> Alright, we're going to try to go upstairs now. If anyone wants to say anything or follow us, they're more than free to do so. But we're not here forever, so you should uh, take your opportunity while you can. Oh. <sighs> okay. Basement? Do you want to go first? <laughs> Sacrifice the lighter one. That too. I, re I, I remember watching someone go down these stairs before and they literally busted their ass going down. Because it's tilted too. And then all this fucking shit on it. Start watching my language. <laughs> this might not be the time. Because if I bust my ass, I am cussing up a storm. This is a lot harder than it looks, trust me. I wore my gloves. People can't laugh at these gloves anymore. That staircase was a no go. Yeah. What this area was for? I don't know. Is there anyone down here with us? Crickets. spot to do them, I guess. Yeah. So many little bricks. I guess these are like dumb waiters, or little elevators to lift up, lift and raise stuff, but it only goes up like one level, so I don't know what, it, what would be the purpose. Maybe these are coolers. Maybe that's what these were. 
that's probably what they were. They were coolers. I was just missing the doors. That's why I couldn't really tell what the hell they were. I'd say some people spend too much time in these places, but uh, I guess so do I. All right, let's, let's see what's outside. So what we're gonna go do is I'm gonna go try to find the exact place where me and Noel were when we came the first time and when we saw the, uh, is that a lower level? Yeah, it is, but it's, it's flooded. It's flooded, buddy. That eliminates that. It's probably just piping the most season. That's good. But yeah, try to reenact the exact placement where we were and where we saw the light the first night that we tried to interact. We kind of briefly talked about it in the first video, but essentially it was <clears throat> we came this way from the back of the hospital from over in this area and wandered around to the back side of the hospital over here, but we couldn't see the hospital exactly, so we didn't know exactly where we were. And then we came to about 50, 60 feet from a light, basically hiding behind a bush. And it was just like crouched down. It didn't glimmer or really glow. It looked like a flashlight solid. Then once every once in a while, it looked like almost like someone was taking a drag off a cigarette and said hello several times, stayed our distance, no response. That just kind of creeped us out more because it was like, I don't know, probably like 1 a.m. So just kind of weird. And so then that's why later having Noel see someone potentially jump out the window in the back kind of spooked him. And then hearing, seeing the other, these other guys that came here a few years prior have the same experience with a light in the back of the hospital just by itself. Interesting, so to say the least. I mean, we can't seem to find the path because this isn't the same road we were on. So unless I walk that same path, we maybe could find it. It just seems so far away, but I mean, just for instance, Sam, just kind of stand behind that bush right there. So if everyone can see where Sam is, he's about right there. What would you say that is? 60, 70 feet? This is about the distance we were, but all it was was a glowing ball about where your fist is, about where your hand is, about that level. Just kind of like crouched down. Yeah, just about like two and a half feet off the ground, just like someone was crouching down. But at that point too, where it was where he was crouching, it looked like almost like it would be marshy, you know, wet, really wet. That's why it was just really weird. And no response back to us at all. Just kind of made it weird. But interesting nonetheless, so who knows? There's a, just an old building back here. There's a couple of old buildings. There's actually uh, like five or six other big buildings around. And we're going to quickly try to check one of those out because no one seems to go there and talk about them. So figure why not give them a little bit of glory too. This could be the trail, actually. Uh -huh. 
No, because it just doesn't, I mean, unless the trail connects back there and it was behind that bush or something, because we didn't come up this far, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to wander that far over there just to check to see about a, a trail. So we're going to call it quits here in this building and go check out the other ones. But I wanted to give anyone else here an opportunity to one, talk to the camera that's on the tripod there. But also I'm going to hold this device and I'm going to hit record. If you have something to say, please come and say it into this device. This is EVP session one. If you'd like to say something, come say it into the device that I'm holding with this orange light. Do you like people coming here to see you? I'm hearing whispers. Sounds like whispers. Do you feel that people ignore you? Do you have a message for us? Did you just touch my hand? I felt something tug my hand. Is that was you? Can you tell me yes or no or do it again? There's also like a dog barking in the background or something. Well, if there's anything you'd like to tell us, this is your last opportunity. All right, thank you. And with that, we're out. Okay. Plant. So this is... Part of the this is the main structure of the other like six buildings that no one ever seems to uh, come to or film or talk about. So I don't know why. I guess maybe they feel like it has nothing to offer. But it's in pretty good size, so at least from what we can tell. It's just kind of hidden back here. That may be also why. Oh, they're all connected by a pathway. Huh. Okay. Uh, well, that makes sense, because it's so overgrown, you can barely see the damn things. Oh, why does this look scarier than the real hospital? Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it looks actually scarier. Um, oh. Maybe people don't like this because it looks newer, but I'm probably going to say it's pretty much the same age. It just looks better intact to a degree. Sounds like a dog, but where did the dog come from? Oh, what the fuck? First it sounded like a fucking loud voice, and then it sounded like a dog, and then it kind of fainted like... Oh, it's a bird. Dude, it's a bird.
I just saw a bird go right here. It went. I think it's, I think it's the bird. Oh god. I was like, what the fuck? Because I was like, where'd the dog come from? <laughs> Fucking birds. down to the other building, one of the connecting buildings, which there are six of, I believe. I'm going to assume they're pretty, they're all kind of the same. Um. Sorry about that camera, camera battery died all of a sudden. for the bird nest. It can stay. They all kind of seem about the same, don't they? Yeah. Just kind of interesting. I'm not sure what this would have been. Overflow or the new hospital? Couldn't tell you. No one ever talks about it really. I'd have to look it up and see. But no one comes here to film either, so that's why. I knew they were here, I just didn't get the opportunity last time, so we decided to look for them this time. So. Still interesting. Alright, 
Well, it's obvious I'm sweating to death. Uh, pretty sure Sam is. So we are going to say goodbye and we're going to go sit in some AC for a while. See ya. Not the mud.